Hi guys, welcome to my channel. I'm D and I am back with a, another video. So first just let me say welcome to all of my subscribers. If you are new here, welcome. If you are a returning subscriber and OG who's been hanging in there with me for the long haul, welcome back. And if you have been watching me and you have not hit that subscription button, what's going on? What are you waiting for? It is free of no cost to you. Just hit the button. Just hit the button. Because over here, if you like handbags, you won't be disappointed. We talk about handbags. Handbags. <laughs> not handbangs. Handbags and more handbags. So, as you can tell from the title... This video is going to be very exciting. I don't know about for you, but for me, because your girl caught the Mother's Day sale with the cold mom. And there were some very interesting pieces available. And I wanted to get my hands on them. Okay. One of them is a wish list item. One is an item that I've been talking about here lately. Um because I was just curious and wanted it because I had some other similar to it and just wanted to kind of compare. So yeah, that's where we are. Um, I haven't been doing a lot, y'all. I've been kind of like scaling back because y'all know I love, love, love to purchase, 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 purchase. That's just me. But um, I have scaled back. I have scaled back. I'm trying to be disciplined and trying to enjoy the bags that I have. However, that doesn't mean I'm going to go on a no-buy or anything like that. I'm just practicing some restraints here, just restraining myself, you know, um, practicing some discipline. Not, let me not say restraint. <laughs> That's a little harsh. But anywho, I know what y'all came here for. So let's get to it. This is a double Dooney and Burke unboxing. These items came from ILD. So, I know I've been noticing here lately that a lot of people want to know where it came from. And to be honest, I never even pay attention. Um, but this came from Orange, Connecticut, I guess. Orange, Connecticut. So, yeah. So, what I'm going to do, I did slip the top open already. Um, I didn't peep. Ooh. And it's packaged very nicely, like it is a new bag. And this is my receipt. Let's see if we have any ducks, because we didn't have them in the other one. I've, I've already removed that one from the box. No ducks, no ducks. show you guys what I have. So y'all, this is the mini satchel in the color brown tomorrow. And it is number 20 of 25. So two things. I don't have a mini in my collection and I was very curious to know um you know how it carries and what fits and things like that because I do have now I have three of the four sizes I have the large I have the regular size I guess they want you want to say the medium I guess and I have a micro and now I have a mini I just don't have the nano and I don't think I ever will get the nano I don't see me getting a nano but who knows um it is a brown tomorrow i do not have one brown tomorrow uh item in my collection at all so this is a first as well the color and the size so let's get her unwrapped so, I got her all unwrapped, y'all. And this is a beautiful color, this brown tomorrow. Now, I did notice that her tassels were not wrapped. And that's okay. 
because I have the makeup brush uh, covers I can put on it. Um, she is not, she's smooth, but not as smooth as, you know, some of my other bags. She has a little bit of pebbling, but it's not bad. And it's consistent throughout the bag. Um, it's not pebble to wear. This is a pebble grain bag. No. <laughs> um, but I love her. And when the smaller the bags are, if they're pebbled, it really doesn't bother me. Like my micro, my micro came totally pebbled, but it came pebbled all over. Um, <clears throat> there weren't any blotches or spots where the pebbling was. Um, it was pebbled all over, and I didn't mind that. See on the sides there, some pebbling. Lord, y'all, this Zuni Florentine smells so good. It smells amazing. See how it's a little pebbled. But she is a keeper. Um, some stripes on the back there. Let's get in her. See, this is what I'm going to like because this is a just right bag. It's not as small as uh, it's not as small as the micro, not as big as the medium, right in between. I love it. And you guys have seen these um, more than enough. Y'all know what it's hitting for. Um, comes with a dust bag because it is the Florentine leather. And it smells heavenly. Um, it has The brown whip stitching, that's so pretty. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. And I'm not going to take all the rest of this off because I don't know when I am going to wear her. Y'all know how I like to do. Typically, I like to wear my darker bags in the winter, fall time. And just for kicks, since I have it right here, pull out the medium size and the chestnut to kind of see the difference in that chestnut and that T-Mara brown. This is a dark chocolate. This is more of a milk chocolate and a dark chocolate. And let's see. That's how it looks from the side for the size purposes. Absolutely Love this bag, y'all. Love it. I am actually right now in a well, the bag of black for last week, which I got out of Saturday. Um, I'm in a large uh Florentine satchel. Absolutely love that bag, y'all. I was so glad when it won the poll because I was like, Whoa, I can get in it. And you'll see why in just a second. So that is my first bag from the mom sale. And it was at a great price, y'all. Because I was so upset when I missed it when it was on clearance. And it was at the same price that it was on clearance on, on the, doing the sale. So I was super excited about... Um, being able to catch that bag at the price. Um, and y'all know that's my thing. I wish this or not, I strive to try to get the bag at the cheapest price that I can. And I keep a 20 off 100 in my back pocket, okay? I keep it in my back pocket. And if I have some extras, I share with my, with my sisters, you know. So next, and I know I've seen a few people already with the bag I'm about to show you guys. But this is my wish list bag. Now, I'm going to be honest with you. This is my wish list bag. My wish list bag was a different size. It was for the medium in this color. And this is why I wanted to carry that bag that I carried last week. Because I ended up getting this baby. And this is in the large. Um, 
Florentine fuchsia satchel, okay? I'm so super excited about this. This is a wish list bag. So excited. I don't remember. I know I remember Mo having this bag in this color. But it was somebody else, and I cannot remember who they were when I first saw it. I was like, whoo, baby. It, it's coming. It's, I, I got to have it. You know, and then, of course, it was never available, just like that Fuchsia Hattie. But I was able to grab that Hattie, baby. Um... But yeah, so I am so excited about adding this bag to my collection. Um, this is so funny, this story. <laughs> because this bag came at an awesome price and it was on ILV. Y'all, I couldn't believe it. My auntie, Auntie Anita. Hey, Auntie Anita. We were on the phone chopping it up or texting, chopping it up. I can't remember if we was talking or what. I don't know what was going on. I think we was texting. And I was like, she was like, girl, I got whatever, whatever. And I was confused because I was like, I know it's on Dooney, but it's free love. And I don't like having to go through all that with the free love thing. And I said, Auntie was like, no, 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 no. All this whole time, I'm thinking she talking about it on Dooney. She's like, no, dear. You know her? No, dear. She's like, it's on ILV. I was like, what? Baby, say no more. I didn't care about no size. I was like, I'm getting this, especially for that price, y'all. You just could not beat it. It was a phenomenal price. And right now, as I'm speaking to you, you guys, ILV is bomb, okay? Because they have their site-wide sale. Um, when they first started dropping these jewels on the website, they, the things weren't on sale. And when I say on sale, I ain't talking about just the line through with the red numbers. I'm talking about an additional. Um, because that's what your girl over here look for. Because y'all know I watch my coins, okay? Um, <clears throat> so, I was super excited about getting this bag. And there's, a, um, there's Auntie Anita... Um, Nita Joe's play therapy. Uh, she um, just unboxed this. Um, so it's probably gonna be a good bit of people because it it actually sold out. This color sold out. So right now, as we speak, I don't think it's available on ILV unless they came out with some more stock. So I'm gonna get her unwrapped and I'll be right back. Now, y'all, this was. 12 of 78. Y'all can see that. 12 of 78. And this mama is smooth. Now this is smooth. This is smooth. Ooh. All of my fuchsias. Help me out. Remove yourself there. <laughs> All of my fuchsia bags are smooth like butter. I don't know if it has to do with the color. I don't know. But this is the back. This is the bottom. All of my fuchsia Florentine is smooth like this. Just gorgeous and smells so good. Gorgeous, gorgeous. So yeah, guys, of course, you know, I will be rocking her pretty soon. Not sure when, but it will be soon. Just wanted to come and bring you guys this double unboxing from ILD. And I'm going to go ahead and sit down somewhere. I'm going to sit down. <laughs> I know all these sales are popping. They're bringing back some things um, that are actually on my wish list. But I'm just kind of sitting back. Uh, you know, I take a while before I do. And my sisters can tell you this in the handbag community. My sisters... They can tell you that I take forever, you know, and I always say if it sell out, it wasn't for me, you know. I just take my time um, with all my purchases. Very seldom you will hear me say I just jumped on it. This has been something I have been wanting forever, so that's what this was about. I had to because this doesn't come along at all. 
This does not come along at all. Now, me and Auntie were going back and forth because she was saying she feel like this might be a little smaller. And it actually does look a little smaller than the normal large. But that's okay because, I, like I said, I'm going to pack my bags anyway. Um, I like for to have a big bag so I can add additional things if I need to add into the bag, you know, throughout the day or throughout the week. So that's fine. But I wanted to come on here and let you guys see what I got into, what kind of damage I did. This is that mini and the large. So that is it, guys. If you guys have any questions about anything that you've seen today, any of the bags that I've shared, please put them down below and let's chat it up. If you guys have the large satchel, if you have any of the satchels, let's talk about it. Let's talk about how you like it versus one versus the other. I'm excited to try this. It'll be in the fall, but I may um just try to see what I can put, fit in it versus what I can fit in the micro and um if you guys would like to see a comparison of the satchels that i have please let me know um if you would like to see um what this i just did one um with all of my satchels so you can refer back to that one because i think i did have the sizes but some people like to see what can fit if you want to see that let me know maybe i can bring that to you too um, but yeah, I'm just so excited about these bags, y'all. Y'all, if y'all trying to build y'all collection and get into this do it thing, baby, be mindful. Be mindful and what they say, um, move with caution. Caution, caution, caution. Because those sales are popping right now. Okay? If you ain't in the right, right mind frame, don't even get on there. Don't get on there. On that note, I'll talk to you guys later. I hope y'all have an awesome, awesome Sunday. Bye-bye.